Hey, what's up guys? Steve from Cult of Mac here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the free app Snapseed to tune your photos to best effect. So, let's get started. Snapseed is a free image editing app from Google that has some fantastic editing tools to make any photo even better. So, here's a quick intro to these fantastic tools and how to make them tune your photos to best effect. Launch Snapseed, then tap on Open Photo button in the lower part of the splash screen. With your chosen photo up on the iPad screen, tap the little pencil icon in the lower right. Then, choose the Tune Image tool to get down to it. If this is the first time you've opened Snapseed, you'll get a little tutorial, explaining that you can adjust the current setting, which is brightness by default, by swiping across the screen left and right. If you swipe up and down, however, you'll be able to choose one of the seven photo adjustments available. Brightness, Ambience, Contrast, Saturation, Shadows, Highlights and Warmth. Swipe your finger and choose brightness to start. Swipe left or right to brighten or darken the entire image. And stay at a subtle number between minus 10 and plus 10. Anything more or less is too much. Next, try ambience. Swipe up to choose ambience from the parameter list. Then adjust ambience with a swipe right or left. Feel free to bump it up all the way to 30 or 35 if you want. Or heck, just slide around until your photo looks the way you like it. Using a negative ambience number will darken shadows and soften up lighter areas for some mood. Hop into contrast settings next, and bump it up a bit to make shadows darker and highlights brighter. Then try out the saturation slider. Colours get more vibrant as you slide to the right. You can slide all the way to the left to make a gorgeous black and white image, or just a little to the right to bring out the colour in a photo. Don't do too much though, as an overly saturated photo never looks quite right. Use the shadow slider to bring in some more detail. But again, don't overuse this one. The warmth slider is lovely for adjusting the overall colour balance of the photo. It's called temperature in other editing apps, and you'll be adding some orange overtones to warm up the photo or some blues to cool it down. See what you can get with just small adjustments. With each of these parameters, you can also use the auto adjust tool near the bottom of the image. This lets the app's algorithms determine the specific adjustment. Finally, to test out your edits against the original, tap on the little preview icon in the upper right. This will show you the original image before the changes you made. Lift your finger up to see the edits. This is a great way to really make sure you've made the changes you want to. Now you've got a simple, free way to tune your photos the best effect, right on your iPad with Snapseed. Well, that's it for this video, but if you've edited any photos using this tutorial, leave a link in the comments down below as I'd love to check them out. Also, if you found this video useful, go ahead and hit that like button as it really does help me out. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit subscribe so you don't miss a single video from Cult of Mac. I'll catch you in the next one.